Hey, good morning everybody. This is Drew with Manaflare Gaming. Um, finally got some time. I got these in uh, probably three days ago now. Um, but I just haven't had the time to put, put a video together and, and open them up for you guys. But uh, it's all here. It showed up. The, uh, the Summer Drop. The Super Summer Super Drop series. Once again, I've got two of each. I'm going to be opening one and saving one. So if you want to, uh, I as of right now, I do have one full complete set of every secret layer, and I have them sealed. So this is gonna go with that. All right, so we have all five drops, and I will do the I'm assuming that is the uh, fetch land. We'll see what happens. So we'll start from the left here with the uh, tattoo pack. Uh, my buddy David told me that uh, a lot of these are fixed. Like the uh, random card that's in here is fixed uh, for a lot of them. But we will see what we have going on. So how are you guys doing with, uh, I don't know if you can hear this, but we got a sweeper running upstairs. We have my wife on a conference call. We have my kids at school. So there's a lot going on around here. Uh, how are you guys doing with the whole homeschooling thing? All right, so we got our, oi, Spell Pierce. It's a good card, I like Spell Pierce. I use it in a few decks, but not a not a super valuable card. We've got our spell pierce, blood artist. That's cool. Eternal witness, very nice. Pithing ne pithing needle, and ink moth nexus. Those are standard standard cards in there. Let's see what we got. Oh, he did say that these are really glued in there this time. Yikes. Oh, there she is. Sorry, Dave. There's the big girl. All her glory. Let's see if I can get a little shine on her there. Look at there. Good old Lily. Dread Horde General. Yeah, I'll get that off later. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. That's a good start to my day. I, uh... I had a long day yesterday. I worked, and then I went to my uh, oldest had baseball practice. We're gonna do Mountain Go now. Then I went to I came home at like seven o'clock. You know, I'm, I'm up, leave the house around seven, seven fifteen in the morning. Go to uh, go to work. Come home. Got home right around five, maybe a little bit after. Went straight to baseball practice, got home around 7, slept for a few hours, and then I had a special project I had to do at work. I had to go in and fix some stuff, but it has to be between uh, 12 p.m. and 6 a.m., so I got all that done. It's a beautiful lightning bolt. Came home, slept for a few hours, and now I'm back at it, so let's see what we got here. Our beautiful lightning bolt. Beautiful lightning bolt. <laughs> beautiful lightning bolt and beautiful lightning bolt. Those are cool. I like the uh, art that goes through the text box like that. I mean, there's only so much you can do for a lightning bolt there. Lightning bolts. I'm not going to set them on there. I'll set them on this. Uh, I want you guys to be able to see these cards, so... Put you back. Oh, oh, yeah, don't forget. Sorry, guys, I'm half awake. You know, getting a couple hours of sleep really puts a damper on your day. Good old row. I think that's the third or fourth row I've pulled. They sell, though. People buy them. Nothing wrong with row. Raw, row, whatever his name is. Ah, I forgot that. I'll get that later when we're not on camera anymore. Let me slide those up. Put these here. 
put these here. There we go. Moving along, moving along, moving along. I always find it hard to uh, to get the positioning just perfect on here. Obviously, I'm no Rudy. But. All right, we've got our. What was this one? Uh, this one was our ornithological studies. So these are birds. Birds. I know you guys are probably itching to open that fetch land. We got our swan song. Little birds of paradise. Little gilded goose. That's a good pair right there. Baleful strix. And dubscape. Dubscape. Okay. You know what I'm going to do to speed this up is actually go a little, go a little faster here. Um. And I'm going to throw this on the ground and not pull the, not pull the special part out again. Oh, that one was barely even stuck in there. Got our Obnixilus. Heat Twisted. Very nice card. It wasn't very exciting, but uh, my buddy David pulled a Ugin. And he got a Misty Rainforest for his other one, for his special card. Can you feel with a heart of steel, baby? Oh, no, it's going to be difficult. What is going on here? Let's see if I can do this backwards. All right, we're going to be a big dumb animal and just tear into it. There we go. That's a lot of glue. <coughs> can you feel with a heart of steel? All right, come out, come out. We got our Arcbound Ravager right up top. Beautiful card. The foiling on these looks really nice. Hopefully they do that. Uh, whatever it's called, the cold, cold foiling on the super drops from here on out. That'd be nice. Arcbound, Dark Steel, and a Walking Ballista. Mm -hmm. Barely get a shine in that thing. All right, and for our, this one's not even glued in here either. What do we got? There's a Karn. Great creator. Nice card. So I pulled a Karn too. Very nice. And our last drop is the path not traveled. I thought it was the path less traveled, was the old adage. There it is. Through the looking glass. These boxes are nice. Wish they were useful for something other than putting a secret layer in. There's our Johnny. Okay, there we go. I always worry about scratching these foils. I know they're so delicate. Johnny. Domery. Goofball. Tamiya. And Veraska. Nice cards. Alright, let's see what we got in here. This is a Tamiya. Nope, it's a Domery. Very nice. Very nice little Domery. All right. And what you guys have been waiting for. What do you guys think it's going to be? I called Arid Mesa. I don't know if you watch my other videos, but these high-end products, I tend to get uh, average to poor pulls. But... 
one of my double masters boxes. You, if you would have watched it, you uh, you would know. <laughs> the other one was okay, just okay. This one, do they have it in backwards? Nope, they do not have it in backwards. So uh, let's do it this way then. All right, is it an Arid Mesa? What do we got? Boom! Hey, Misty Green Forest. Very nice, blue green. I uh, likes it. All right, what do we end up with? We got our Domri, Karn, Rowl. I gotta get that sticky icky off of there. And a Misty Rainforest. Not a bad pull, I'm all right with that. That's pretty above average, so I will take it. All right guys, let me know what you think down in the uh, comment section below and don't forget to like, subscribe. Check us out for more, more good content. Also visit our eBay store, anything on eBay. Uh, if you mes message me directly, you can have 10% off. And other than that, you guys have a great day. Thanks now.